Any high points in the story of IntelliKey and your work with learning disabilities and the arts? This project has been going on for 22 years now. There have been many high points. I think one of them early on was someone that I'd been working with in the service because of his difficulty and his behaviour. And I came as a member of the audience to see him in a performance and it was so enlightening for me that this man that I'd known in the hospital, who'd had a very, very difficult life, was now feeling free enough to express himself in a performance and doing things that I couldn't imagine myself doing. And so it was a wonderful time when afterwards he came and said, did you see me up there? Did you see me doing that? And it was such a lovely thing to have been part of that he had found something that was rewarding for him outside all the difficulties that he'd experienced in his life and his responses to those difficulties and other people's responses of trying to keep him down really in my view this was a chance for him to blossom and that was lovely to see and I th I think the first time they did, Entelechy did a whole ensemble performance in the Albany here with uh, participants from a two-year-old to a 92-year-old. It was just very, very interesting and engaging and wonderful theatre. And it had been produced by all these disparate people coming together who, wouldn't otherwise have met each other and wouldn't otherwise have been performing and having this part in the arts which was very, very interesting to see and I think the progress of Entelechy and the opportunities it's given so many people has been, it's the pinnacle of my career to have been at all instrumental in starting this off and see how how it's blossomed and developed, and the people in it have blossomed and developed. So I'm very pleased to have been part of it all these years.